Wow, this looks amazing. Uh, you feel more of um, vitality? I'm always very, uh, you know, high vitality. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> Hello everyone, my name is John Yu. I'm 31 years old, Korean American, and I live in New York City. This is my simple morning routine and what I eat. To give some background, I've trained over 290 clients and these two simple healthy recipes have helped change lives. I hope by the end of the video, this provides some value on your health journey. If not, I appreciate you watching anyway. Thank you so much. Good morning. I feel a little bit more awake now. I'm actually not a morning person. I don't know how you guys do it, waking up really early. It's not even that early right now, it's about 7.30. You know, in the past, I tried to wake up even earlier to try to get more stuff done during the day, but I value good sleep now, which I very foolishly overlooked in the past. So if you're in sleep deprivation, sacrificing sleep is, it seems to be an easy solution to getting more stuff done, but in the long run, it it hurts your health, it hurts your heart. But anyway, uh, I'm not talking about sleep in this video, I'm talking about two things, my morning routine and my diet. I think I wanna oh, oh, oh. I love the way your skin reminds me of the days when we were young and free A simple melody could take us to a place where it's just you But when you're out there I'll be waiting here back home, wondering if you're missing me. So the ingredients that I'll be using are the following. We have sweet potatoes, red pepper, avocado. These are the baby ones. They ran out of the big ones at Whole Foods, pediatric ones. Spinach, and of course, can't forget protein source, chicken breast. Chicken breast, it's like my girlfriend. I will never leave chicken breast. If chicken breast were a person, I would be married by now. It's kind of, kind of weird thing to say, but yeah, let's get started. I'm gonna wash my sweet potatoes. But usually I meal prep. One thing you could do to save time besides meal prep is to stick stuff in the air fryer. So usually what I do, I'll go in the shower and I'll have this stuff prepping in the air fryer. I'm gonna have this starting because those sweet potatoes take a long time. So I use complete seasoning. You could use salt, pepper, whatever, whatever you feel like. But this tastes just as good. Uh, so while that's cooking, oh, it already smells good. I'm gonna slice up some onions. Cup. Next thing I'm gonna do is slice up my chicken breast. Or some people like to use some sauce. Feel free to, just remember that adds extra calories and fat, so just be careful using that stuff. I'm gonna throw it in here. Okay. We're off to a great start. Right, this is the first time ever that I'm cooking on camera. It's something that I've always been self-conscious about because I'm not that good at it. Forgive me if I make mistakes. Let's prepare some of the peppers. These are a proper way of putting this. I love bell peppers and they're delicious. Can add onions, peppers, garlic to just about anything. So we have prepared our sweet potato. You can see how juicy this chicken is. Take a look. Ooh. Wow. Mmm, amazing. Oh my God, so good, so juicy. Hey, let's go, it smells amazing. Again, like I said, my presentation is pretty abysmal. Our last thing I want to do is the broccoli. It's easy, this is already prepped for me, so I'm just gonna stick this in here. What could be easier than this, right? Wow, this looks amazing. Holy crap. There's other stuff that I want to use 
here. If you have any tips also, uh, easy recipes, please let me know. I want to be able to cook for my friends, for my family. And no one's asked me to cook because they know that this stuff isn't, it's not that tasty. I think it's tasty, but it's not like something you would crave, right? Oh, I forgot the spinach, damn. The cool thing about the spinach is, uh, you know what, I'll just add it. It's much easier to eat a cup of spinach when it's like a tiny little ball that it turns into. Boom. Gains. Here's my chicken breast. Mmm. I love that. More sweet potato. Mm. In terms of healthy lifestyle, healthy gains, take it from someone who sucks at cooking. It's worth your energy, it's worth your time. Approximately 10 hours later. Oh, it's recording. Yeah. I think this is fun, except the part where it goes to the public. <laughs> Oh, like you want this to be an act, like a private activity. It can be. Special guests. The dogs. We're gonna cook up some salmon and some assorted vegetables that we haven't used yet. Okay. Okay, make sure you get your hairspray. Can I put it in? You see. While we're doing the air frying, we're going to slice pasta. up some vegetables. Oh, this is pasta. Ooh. Can I have some ginseng? Yeah. Ginseng? I love ginseng. You want to try? Yeah, I want to try. Uh, actually, um, while we're at it, I'm excited to introduce a product that I've been consuming since my childhood, Korean Red Ginseng by KGC. Korean Ginseng has been used in traditional Eastern Asian medicine for centuries, a widely used herb that boosts the energy levels in the body. A research study conducted at Korea University showed positive effect on both exercise performance and shorter recovery time for fatigue for subjects who consume Red Ginseng for 8 weeks. KGC is the world's largest Ginseng brand, is the most reputable manufacturer of Korean Red Ginseng. KGC has made it easy for anyone to incorporate Korean Red Ginseng into to daily routine. My personal favorite is the KGC Every Time, packaged in stick pouches that contains the most concentrated and purest six years grown Korean red ginseng root. I consume the Core Select Energy Stick before my workout for a natural energy boost without the caffeine and jitters. Use my link to get 15% off and start the new year the healthiest version of you. This makes a fantastic gift idea. It's always been well received. Now back to the show. It's a liquid. Yeah, go ahead. I just drink it. Uh-huh. Oh, you drink it a very interesting way. Usually people just go like this. <laughs> <laughs> you drink it like as a cup. Well, it's so strong. It's good though. It's good. Every time. I eat this every morning. But do you feel more um, vitality? I mean, I'm always, I'm always very, uh, you know, high vitality. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> all right, everybody, all right. Should we cut it open? Yeah. Watch out, it's hot. Yeah, I want to higher the heat. You want to higher the heat? Yeah, yeah, because I just keep the top. Well, <laughs> raise the heat. Okay. <laughs> you want to? You, you want to? You want to employ the the, the uh, <laughs> fire? <laughs> you fire the fire? Oh, well, she's she's really brilliant, guys. She's really brilliant. What does this taste like? What are you? Yeah, what am I? What am I? What am I? You're a complete seasoning? No, no, no. What, what am I? <laughs> a complete snack. No, I'm a spice girl. We are going to taste test. Let's see what the verdict is. The pasta is bomb too. That's amazing pasta. Wait, it's actually, the salmon is actually really good. I really like it. Complex carbs. The ass paragraphs. 
<laughs> I love eating asparagus. <laughs> Do you? Drop a comment with your favorite recipe. How about that? Mm-hmm. We can try it. Mm. I cook it. Just want to also say thank you to our sponsor. I'll get you a box. Oh really? Okay. I feel energized. <laughs> I took it ten minutes ago.